space, a frontier we apparently need to stop exploring. In Infinity, a rescue team is sent to an outpost on the edge of the known universe, only to find death eagerly awaiting them. Now, this is fun, fast-paced sci-fi that's injected with suspense and some bloody horror, so you know I liked it. Wit Carmichael is a professional soldier with a wife and a baby on the way. An investigation into the mysterious Infinity Mining Station goes horribly wrong, and he's accidentally transported there alone. Now, a rescue team is quickly sent, but not just because of him. There's something on that planet that is a threat to the Earth itself. When the team arrives on the station, they not only find Wit alive, but something turned the miners and all of the staff into bloodthirsty savages, and it's still hanging around. This is a gritty story that does not hold back, but it doesn't really go for the gusto either. Now, the violence can be quick and intense, but the gore level just wasn't as high as I was expecting. Had this film embraced its dark side, it could have been a pretty good horror movie. Instead, it's the story of a hero trying to keep it together, stay alive, and figure out an alien threat that's endangering the Earth. Now, the special effects, the props, the sets, they're all pretty good here, but this is a film that relies on the directing and the acting to deliver its intensity. The actors in this movie really embody what we should fear, where in other films they relied on the special effects. The cast does an excellent job of not only giving us soldiers in the ultimate crap has hit the fan moment, but people fighting to remain human. When they undergo this change, there are some physical effects they use to see the differences. Mostly that's done by makeup. It's up to the cast to bring the monsters into this movie, and they did it. This film has very few slow moments in it. It gets right to the action at the start. It was so fast that I think I missed a few plot holes while I was watching it, and that's not necessarily a bad thing. I even enjoyed the interesting sci-fi concepts they came up with that probably don't match up with actual science, like how they perform space travel and what the big threat is. This is a movie where you need to take the physics book out of your brain and just enjoy it. While Infinity is the kind of story you've seen before with some of the same old problems, it still entertains with intense character work and quality filmmaking. Watch this one when you want good sci-fi action, but you don't want to think too much. Just feel.